I attended Fort Union Military Academy in Fort Union, Virginia. Fort Union was unique in a sense that, you know, it was an all-boys school. We wore uniforms every day. We had to shine our shoes, shave our face, keep our hair cut. Each day was structured. We had class and then we'd do military training. We called it drill. And then we had practice. Just the discipline aspect there definitely helped prepare me for college. It wasn't only my high school team there. We also had a postgraduate team. So, you know, they put out 20 Division One players each year. So I usually worked out with those guys when I could. And I think that definitely helped me adjust to the speed of the next level. He was recruited by everybody. I know that Alabama recruited him and Miami recruited him and obviously Virginia. Penn State, I thought it was a great opportunity for me. Coach O'Brien coming in from the Patriots, bringing in that type of offense, I felt like I fit that very well. He's the perfect fit for what we try to do offensively here. He's big, tall, strong, he can run. He's got a good arm, he's accurate, he's smart. We had an offense that I felt fit his talent level and, and that that would be a big part of his decision. The executive committee, the Division I board and I have agreed upon the following sanctions. Penn State football will be banned from bowl games and any other postseason play for four years. I verbally committed February of my junior year. That July, the sanctions were placed on the program. The most impressive thing about Coach O'Brien was how he communicated with you. He was honest with you throughout the entire process. The guy had many, many opportunities to go wherever he wanted to go and coach, but you know he decided to stick through it. So if you have his word, you really can't go back on yours, even if you wanted to, and I, I didn't want to. Signing day was wild. People talking about how it was our flip. To finally be able to put the pen to the paper, it was special. He was the number one quarterback on our recruiting board from everything that you look for in a quarterback. We were extremely excited when he chose to come to Penn State. Going into Michigan, you know, it's a whiteout, Beaver Stadium, five o'clock. You knew it was gonna be a brawl. Smash Mouth football, I think it, you know, really exemplifies what the Big Ten is all about. Before the Michigan game, he kept saying to me that he had a really good feeling about this game. Hackenberg delivers in the end zone. Caught, touchdown, Penn State. He won the starting quarterback job really about the second week of training camp when he led our team down the field in Beaver Stadium on a two-minute drill that ended in a touchdown. So, down seven, looking to tie. Your 18-year-old quarterback in charge. Everyone sort of knew, like, this is our chance to really go out and, and execute it and actually do it for real. Steps up in the pocket, delivers it long and deep downfield for Robinson, leaps high in the air, he's got it! Inside the five at the pylon, it's at the one-yard line with 27 seconds to go! What a catch! 27 seconds to go, a half yard away, down 34-27. Quarterback sneak, right side, touchdown, Penn State! Best game I've ever been a part of. That's another area where we gotta take the game to the next level, is just really understanding all of our protections. They're not doing everything that we thought they were gonna do. Okay, how do we adjust? Reading defenses for a young quarterback is very difficult. When you make the jump from high school to college and you play right away, that's one of the things that you really need to improve on on a week-to-week -week basis. Pack, you take it. The fullback has Sam to who? To the corner. Or the safety, the, the strong safety. Yeah, corner safety. I think when he sees the film on Monday and he misses plays, he gets frustrated because he knows that he can do better. Be Hack senior year, he'll be like, Hack, this is Ty Howell. You remember me? I was your center, your freshman. Who? I got a bad connection. You need what? Started out the offensive line, me, Ty, some of the seniors, we tried to take some of the things off his plate. But week by week, he slowly takes on more and more responsibilities to the point where he's really on top of everything. <laughs> 